what's going on youtube welcome back to another video so guys today the 50 car five story eclipse boulevard garage has been released and it's now available for purchase so in this video we're gonna buy it we're gonna check it out and i'm gonna tell you guys everything that you have to know about it so first of all if you want to get it go to dynasty 8 normally it will be at the top you can see that it's 2.74 million which is quite a lot but keep in mind it's 50 cars that you can store in here when you click on it, you will see that you have the option to select the interiors. For the interior, first of all, you have three different styles, Immaculate, Industrial, and Indulgent. Immaculate, the first one, is kind of the standard style that you always see. So I really recommend that you guys try to pick at least Industrial or Indulgent so that it will look different than your other garages. Then you can also choose the color. So the color, as you guys can see, it changes kind of the lights or the bars that you have at the top. You also have a small room in the back, it changes the interior of this. And then also the equipment in the back, it will also change colors. As you guys can see, the interior doesn't affect the price. So go ahead and pick what you want. Also keep in mind, the interior that you pick right now will be the interior for all five floors. You can change it later on for each floor separate, but this will cost you extra money. So make sure that you think about it, make sure that you pick something nice. So the garage itself is over here on Eclipse Boulevard. If you want to access it, you don't have to go to the back. Just in the front, you can see that there is two garage doors. And when you try to park a car in there, you will get the option between the five different basement levels. Something similar that we have, for example, in the garage for the CEO office or the nightclub or the arena. So the interior looks pretty good in my opinion. It's something different from what we are used to, so that's always a good thing. On each floor in the back, you will have this room over here with a kitchen, also a TV that you can watch. And then also over here, you will have a laptop that you can use to watch the security footage. So you can watch the front of the garage, the roof and stuff like this. Then over here, you also have the equipment from the garage. You also have a laptop that you can use to go on the internet. Pretty standard stuff. And for the rest, of course, it's a garage. So don't expect that you can do a lot of things in here. At the entrance of the garage, you have the blue circle that you can use to move around your cars. One thing that is kind of annoying though, is that you cannot move cars between floors, at least it seems so. And this is something that we have seen with other garages that have multiple floors as well. Near the entrance, there is also an elevator, of course, that you can use to go to the different levels. And if you want, you can also go to the roof of the garage, where you also will have a couch and stuff like that. And you can also chill over here. Now, one important thing that you guys should know is how to change the interior of the different floors. Because like I said, when you first buy it, all of the floors will have the same interior. But afterwards, you can change the interior of each floor separately. But this will cost you money. So if you go to the interaction menu, you will have the option Eclipse Boulevard Garage. Then the second option, Customize Floor. And then you can basically, first of all, customize the style. Keep in mind, when you do this, you will always first get a preview and then you will have to pay. And then besides that, you can also change the color. So when you do this, it will change the interior of the floor that you are currently on and only for this floor. So not for everything. If you want to change the interior for everything, you will have to do it separately and you will have to pay every time, which will cost you quite a lot of money. So as an example, go to customize floor. I pick indulgent. So this is a different style. First of all, I get to see how it looks and then I can actually buy it by pressing X again on PlayStation and it will cost me 265k. Then if I press square on PlayStation, you can see the options at the bottom right, by the way. I can also change the colors. Again, the same system. First, when you select it, you will get a preview and afterwards you have the option to buy the color for 75k. So just to show you guys, right now I press X again on Indulgent. So I have the preview. I press X again to buy it. Like I said, the options are at the bottom right. And then the 265K will go off of my account. And right now the second floor, only the second floor has this style. Now I didn't confirm the color yet. So if I exit the menu, you can see that it's still red. If I want to confirm the color as well, like I said, press square to switch to the color. First get the preview. Then you have to press X again to pay the 75k. The 75k will go off of your account. And now this floor and only this floor is changed. So keep that in mind. The other floors, if you go back, they will still have the old interior. 
So that's also why I said make sure that when you buy the garage, you pick the interior good. Because if you want to change it, you will have to do it for each floor separately. And you will also have to pay the 265k plus the 75k, which is quite a lot if you have to do it five times. Also something that I wanted to mention guys, if you buy a new car and if you want to park it in the 50 car garage, you don't get an option surprisingly for the level that you want to put it on. So this means that if you buy a new car, it will always put it on the first level or if the first level is full, it will put it on the second level. And if you want to change the level, you will have to drive out of the garage and drive back in and then select the level that you want. And then the last thing is that you could not park bikes in this garage. So I tried to buy a bike and then this garage was not an option. So guys, that was it. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Make sure to like, subscribe, check out the Discord in the description and peace out you guys.